Most people in America are familiar with what is and isn't their technical rights. Yet there are police officers, there are law enforcement people, there are satanic sheriffs that want to be in control of people by staying in the shadows. They live in the shadows of life. The shadows of life are in our jails. The shadows of life are just like the Sandman in the marvelous film and dark kind of thriller, Batman. Batman didn't used to be that sort of a thing. It used to be a comedy on TV where they wore tights and crazy type of outfits. But the reality is it was a funny program and it taught people about how to love life in a way, how to be a superhero. But today's superhero are having to get darker in order to win in a land of chaos. America has become less smorgasbord and less buffet and more a chaotic cooking show in a way. What I mean by that is that we can cook up our own life, but we have to cook up our own life based on our own skills and our own talents. The minute you start trying to cook up your life by stealing from other people, you destroy the fabric of America. You destroy the reason you came here. You see, if you came to America to look for a good life, to get out of your home country, to be a free citizen, great for you, but not good for me. Because what your attitude is, I will take what I want, I will do what I please, and I won't care about laws in America. But it's laws in America that keep you motherfuckers safe as visitors, and it's laws in America that keep us as citizens safer than others. But we have people, white, black, Hispanic, Muslim, Native American, Indian, and Chinese, Korean. I would say, generally speaking, rarely Japanese. Because most of them don't have any problem returning home to their own socialistic nation. Where people pretty much do live free. Their society controls, but it's still a good place to be. America is full of Russians and others that don't want to leave. For some reason, we allowed the intelligence networks to come across the borders and across the seas. Come here with your intelligence. Come here with your creative skill set. Come here with your musical talents in the Korean language. Like we need that here. I don't think so. We have our own dance troops. We have our own black athletes. We have our own globetrotters. We have our own everything like across the seas. And openly, they're just not discovered yet because American famous people like Ellen and others are putting too much interest in foreign entities and not enough interest in small global opportunities. I can say that now because I used to be a fan, but I'm not a fan of someone who makes fun of their guests and mocks them and, and destroys them or scares them out of their wits. It's an immoral act. It's against the Lord's house, and God is displeased with that. And what do you know? She's got COVID. In life and in the world, we have a right to help people. It's true. But when you give away millions of dollars and still allow people to remain homeless, Hapless is what some people say, and that's not true. We have people across America that will attack a homeless person. We have people across a community of impoverished thinking that will piss on you. We have people who think, I will be in power over you until I get you to do what I want you to do. And the truth is, God didn't die and leave you God. God did not say, Debbie, Cindy, Terry, Jim... You are now Jesus Christ in that man's life. You see, I can throw out any name. I can throw out the name Jane. I can throw out the name Robert. I can throw out the name Andrew. I can throw out the name Kayla. I can throw out the name of Christopher. I can throw out the name of any name. Jonathan, Lauren, Claire, anything. And I can say to you, who the fuck are you in my life? Have you ever once gave a shit about what I was doing for my life? my family, my son. And maybe you did for a short time, but then what happened? You decided that your version of life for me was better than my version of life for me, and maybe I should turn around and do that to you and your family tree. 